Jeez. Good morning everyone and welcome to another episode of Fishing with Rod. We are here in Cayucat once again. Had a really successful morning targeting our lingcod and rockfish, got our limits of each. And now we're out here for some halibut. Dave, we're here for big ones, right? Yeah, try for big ones. We're going to try for the big ones and I asked you earlier when you're out for halibut and you're looking for the larger ones, what kind of structure do you look for in the sounder? Rock. Lots yeah, of rock. Lots of rock. Snaggy bottom. Some place where you'd think a bigger fish would get another fish or mm -hmm. an octopus or something. Right? It's almost like the high spots are like the like the garbage dump for bears. Oh perfect. Right? That's a good analogy. Yeah. So they, they don't live on that rocky spot, but they come to the rocky spot at tide to look. Right? So we just get here before and uh, put on our scent, and hopefully at the tide they'll come. It's tides at 8:30 this morning, so that's why we're in a hurry. Get our lings and stuff to get in here an hour before the tide. Uh, it was pretty quick. Oh, when you let we left the dock, you said that we had to be here for eight, and we're right on schedule. I did not think that we would get both species that quick, yeah, and cool. then we were out here early enough to actually drop the. The, the anchor down, the bait bag, we got three rods, I think, running. A couple, one has a salmon head on it, and these two, I didn't see what you added on them. Yeah, just, just, just how a little bit or wing cod from last night. Okay. Right. Trying to use the scraps for bait. Well, it's perfect. Just you don't want it. anything to go to waste. No, it's perfect. So we have about 20 minutes to wait until peak uh, time. Yeah. Super That's calm so out. Oh, 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 oh. Is that bottom? Huh? Is that bottom? I don't know. What fishy. I was I was mentioning to Rod earlier that I haven't I haven't reeled up a really big halibut in a long time. Every year we come here, we're always looking for the two two unders. In deep water, right? In deeper water, and we're fishing shallower water. Well, if you think 134 is shallow, is it shallow? Yeah, that's shallow. Okay, 134 for big halibut. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do. But these fish are hungry. I mean, they're going to take that bait and hopefully swallow it. Yep. Yeah, so see a piece of halibut left over. They're still early though. There's Just will it to happen? up once it was just bouncing right off bottom and it's gonna happen fast it's just gonna be like triple header something's nibbling see that go no nope. okay what could it be if it's not a halibut That gets everybody's attention, right? You get a little fish there. Moving little, around. Then the big ones say, hmm, the little one can eat it. Maybe I can. Mm -hmm. oh, 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 this one. It, it did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's good. That's right. But that's it's the one you have to reel up. It's the same one that was there. So it okay, a, so they're bouncing back. It might be a smaller halibut. They can't get that one in his mouth. If we get a small one, are we trying to keep it, or are we just going for big? Well, it's, a small is still big. But if it's under, I mean... It won't be under. It won't be under. Is that confident? Frick. Oh. See something? But it, it should violently bend, not just a little bit. Oh. Uh. No, that's... That's water. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Tides changing. Yeah. Okay, we're almost peak. That sunfish didn't hang around too long. 
Oh, that's on the bottom. Probably a small one pecking at it. Fish tapped one rod, sniffing another. Didn't go over to the salmon head though. I thought you said there was no small ones here. Oh, that'd be interesting. Could it be a link on? Could be, yeah. Octopus? Yeah, could be. What do you think? I see something. Dogfish? Ling cod? Ling. What is it? Halibut. <laughs> Ling. Oh, it's... oh, what is that? What is it? Ling. That's Ling cod. They're bottom of fish. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Link hot. Link hot. Yeah. Same one. Yeah. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Bugger. So clear. Ready, Kate? I'm ready. I can reel up. I can hook it. Okay, I would grab it. Yep. Side of the room. Side of the room. Hard, 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 hard. Top reel. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, That's a big one. <laughs> I was watching the bites though. The bites weren't huge. I'm trying to remember how to reel these up. I don't want to reel when he's moving. No, yeah, we're doing good. Slow though? Yeah. Slow and steady. Oh no. I stole the line it gained. Doing it the kind of pansy way, <laughs> leaving it in the rod holder. How big do you think it is? Oh, uh, some, yep. Yeah. No, making some gains for sure. It pulled quite a bit to start. 
Get everything ready. We got a shark hook. We got a harpoon. Got the cameraman. The cameraman. Got a massive 100 pound fish. Measuring device. Oh! No! No! Sorry. It's going to take a little longer than I thought. Did you, did you see it? No, no, no. But I had I was reeling up the whole time, yeah. and then it went on a big oh. run. You had him up to thirty feet. Where is he at now? One thirty. Oh, <laughs> like aren't we fishing at one thirty? He's back on the bottom. I just don't want to lose him. Do you remember last year when I had it mm -hmm. all the way up to the top? Yeah. Don't jinx it, kitty. Here he is. Okay, out of the rod holder. Well, I was trying to give you some slack because I was watching the rod tip bend when I was bringing it over. That's and then I, I didn't want the, the weight to hit you. That's the perfect size. Yeah. And why is it the perfect size? Well, because we were able to deal with it. We didn't have to measure it because we know what's under. Right? It's probably like one... Or over. 18, something like that. 118? Yeah. You want to measure it? Just to... Sure. 112. Yeah, perfect. So what's the maximum size? 133 is the maximum for a large. That's perfect. Yeah. 20? 20. Just get right in there. It's all blood. Big for big fish. Okay. I don't know if I want to hold it. <laughs> Oh my gosh! How do I hold this thing, Rod? 